Thanks. Welcome back, everyone. We're almost to 5.15 on this kind of tired Tuesday morning. <laughs> it's, everybody's back to work today, and it's starting off a little foggy. We're in Branson right now, and you can see it just looks a little hazy. Our most dense fog is actually for our northern counties where we have a dense fog advisory. 64 degrees in Branson, calm winds, that dew point at 64. That's why we're seeing a little moisture in the air bringing all of that fog. So places like Clinton, Lake of the Ozarks, Camdenton, we're looking at reduced visibility there, West Plains, Mountain Home, all across the area. So as you head out this morning, just be aware fog could be a possibility. Make sure your lights are on. Give yourself a little extra room. It's not like it was last week in Springfield. Uh, it looks like north north of us. It is seeing that real thick pea soup fog currently on our satellite and radar. We've got a little bit of cloud coverage up to our northwest or northeast and then down to the south. It's kind of the same situation that we were in yesterday. The area of low pressure off to our east is going to kind of bring in a chance of a few afternoon pop up showers. Here they go, 10:30 a.m. You can see very, very isolated, scattered cells popping up on our future cast across the area. Same situation as we head into the 2:30 hour. I mean, most places aren't going to see much rain, but if you saw some yesterday, it's the best likelihood of seeing rain. Mostly sunny skies. I think we're going to see sun a lot quicker today than we did yesterday. And then as we head into Wednesday, we're going to clear out nicely and we're going to see very dry conditions for the middle part of the week as high pressure moves back in and takes control. So if you're wondering, when can I mow? When can I do my hay? I would say there's that slight chance of rain today. Better chance of staying dry for your Wednesday and Thursday. Our next best chance of rain, man, and it's not a real great chance over the weekend as a cold front moves through. It looks like it's going to be a pretty dry cold front. For today, temperatures topping out in the low 80s. 85 is average for this time of the year, so 82. We're a little bit below average. We will see lots of sun for the sun. <laughs> tonight, I should say mid 60s across the area. We're going to start to see lows in the 50s soon. As we head into the weekend, we're going to see this pattern shift and it's going to be a front not looking like a ton of rain with this front as the showers are going to push more to our east. We're going to see a shot of cool fall air and look at this seven day forecast. I have declared I'm going to say Sunday just because I've got stuff to do on Saturday, but I have declared it a soup day as highs are going to be about 76 degrees. It's going to be really nice. Other than that, this week temperatures are going to hang out in the mid 80s, which is nice. Jesse, you making soup? Uh, well, I was going to make it on Saturday, but since you have stuff to do, um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, everybody across the area, no Saturday soup. <laughs> <laughs> Natalie's busy. Wait till Sunday. <laughs> That's <your> right. <laughs> which is the first day of uh, the Chiefs football season. Woohoo! So, going to be real nice. <laughs>